One of these nickname options has over 30 name possibilities. You guys are gonna love this list. Hi, my name is Steph. I am a name consultant, a content creator, an author, a mom of three, and a lover of all things whimsical, and I am so glad you're here for this video. Who else agrees that nicknames have them in a chokehold? Because me, totally. I am absolutely obsessed with finding interesting and creative ways. I love a feminine name with a masculine nickname, a masculine name with a feminine nickname. I love gender neutral nicknames. My daughter's name is Oriana, and we call her Ori. I am obsessed with nicknames. The beauty of nicknames is that they can make a traditional classic sounding name into something brand new and contemporary. I also love Love that you can go by a given nickname. You do not have to pick the longer version, so consider these all as baby name inspiration for your list. I have five feminine names and five masculine names, and of course I have honorable mentions. Let's jump in. Let's start with the girls' names, and yes, I am going to read them because it would be crazy to have to memorize all of them, okay? So we're going to start with the lowest amount of nicknames that I could find and go to the highest. And yes, there are other names that have lots of nickname potential. These are the ones that I wanted to share that I felt had the most versatility. Eleanor. If you like Eleanor, what about L, Ellen, Ellie, Lenore, Lena, Lenny, Leo, Lonnie, Laura, Nell, Nora and Nori. That is 13 options for Eleanor. What do you think? <laughs> the next name is Catherine and we have 14 different options for Catherine. Okay, for Catherine we have Kat, Cassia, Kate, Kath, Kathy, Katie, Katya, Kit, Kitty, Rena, Rini, Rin, and Teeny. I can't throw this one because it's got other names on it. <laughs> okay, the next name is Penelope. For Penelope, you could go with L, Ellie, Nell, Nellie, Lenny, Lola, Loppy, Opie, Pella, Pelly, Pen, Pens, Penny, Polly, and Poppy. It's pretty cool. Again, can't throw it, so. Um, there are 15. That was 15 nicknames for Penelope, okay? We're going to move on to the second highest, which, let's be real, this one is insane. I think you could probably guess the top two. We we're going to do Margaret first, okay? There are 21 nicknames for Margaret on this list. We have Daisy, Etta, Eddie, Gaga, Gigi, Greta, Gretchen, Gretel, Madge, May, Maggie, Maisie, Margie, Margo, Marnie, Meg, Mimi, Pearl, Peggy, Polly, and Rita. That is fantastic. Are you ready for the one that has 30 names? Are you ready? It is, of course, <laughs> it is, of course, the beautiful Elizabeth. Whew. All right, let's see. How fast can I do them all? Ready? If you like Elizabeth, what about one of these nicknames? B, Bess, Beth, Betsy, Bet, Betty, Birdie, Biddy, Busy, Buffy, Eliza, Elise, El, Elspeth, Etta, Izzy, Libby, Liddy, Lilibet, Lily, Lisette, Lissy, Liz, Liza, Lizbeth, Lizette, Lizzie, Tabby, Teddy, and Zabby. And then my bonus name for girls is going to be Isabella. I did write them out. There are 17, but because Isabella is like a variation on the name Elizabeth, I just felt like it was too similar to put in here, but it's actually a very different name. So here you go. Bella, Belle, Bells, Billy, Ella, El, Ellie, Ibby, Issa, Izzy, Libby, Sab, Sable, Sabella, Sabelle, Sella, and Sibby. And then my other honorable mentions that if you were like, oh, I need some more names that have all of this potential, you can look at Alexandra, Christina, Dorothea, Genevieve, Matilda, and Wilhelmina. Let's move on to the boys. So my highest nickname count for a boy name was 23. Put in the comments if you think you can guess what it is. We're going to start with the name Jonathan. And as someone who talks about the overuse of a name like John, I actually really like the name Jonathan. It's very versatile and it makes me think of Jonathan Taylor Thomas, who I had a huge crush on growing up. <laughs> for Jonathan, we have 12 nicknames. And those include J, Jet, Joe, Joey, Johnny, John, Jonas, Jono, Jaunty, Nathan, Nate, and Than. Would you use any of those? Let's move on to the name Robert. We have 13 nickname options for good old Robbie Robert. What about Bert, Birdie, Bo, Bob, Bobby, Dobbs, Dobbin, Hobby, Hobbs, Rob, Robbie, Robin, and Obi. Thoughts? 
Next up, we have the name Nicholas. This is probably one of my favorite classic boy names. I don't think I talk about it very often, but I love Nicole and I love the name Nicholas. And these nicknames are not fire, so. Cozy in, we've got 15. <laughs> if you love Nicholas, what about Cole, Colin, Colson, Colt, Kel, Claus, Lass, Nico, Nikos, Nick, Nichols, Nikki, Niels, Noel, and Ollie. I try to make sure they have some consonants that come from the name because there are lots of options. Like really, truly, you don't need to have a nickname that works. Like I knew a Harold who went by Buddy. You don't have to absolutely have a nickname that comes from the name, but these are the ones that are inspired by the root name. Okay, does that make sense? Like don't hold yourself back if you really love a nickname. It just might be harder for people to catch on to it. I've been forgetting to throw the papers, so that's sad. Now we're going on to William. William is a, is a classic boy name and it's got lots of options. We have 18 nickname potentials. If you love William, what about Biff, Bill, Billy, Dubs, Lee, Lem, Lemmy, Liam, Wells, Wiley, Wilkie, Will, Willie, Willem, Willis, Wills, Wilt, and Wim. <laughs> that was crazy fast. <laughs> I know a lot of Liams in school, not a lot. Uh, quite a few are actually Williams, um, but I think people don't realize like Liam stands alone. Like people also think of Liam as a standalone name. All of these can be standalone names. Think of Wells and Wills, those are so cute. Wim, no, maybe not Dubs. Maybe not Dubs, maybe, maybe not Dubs. Actually, I need this because it's got the honorable mentions. Sorry. Drum roll, please. The boy name with the most nickname options is Alexander. I have 23 ideas for Alexander. Let's let's see what they are, shall we? Al, Alec, Alex, Alexi, Ali, Anders, Andy, Axel, Dex, Ender, Lex, Sander, Sonder, Sandro, Sandy, Sasha, Sasho, Xan, Xavier, Xandy, Zan, Xander, and Zane. Notice how I make the X and the Z sound different, but a lot of people don't, so it's fine. And this, the pronunciation, it's like, is it Sander or Sonder? Is it Anders or Anders? It, it's whatever you want it to be. It's whatever you want it to be. Anyway, I can get rid of this now. We're down to our last two. So I do have a, um, a bonus as well for the boys. And it is the name Christopher, which I actually thought there would be way more. And I was struggling to come up with a ton of them. I actually, I only have 11. So I was kind of surprised by that. But let's see, if you like Christopher, what about Chip, Chris, Christoph, Crispin, Critter, Kip, Kit, Tof, Topher, Topper, and Toto. Those are pretty darn cute. Those are pretty darn cute. That paper went everywhere. And then finally, my honorable mentions for boys names that you can find a lot of nickname potential are Charles, Edward, Frederick, and Theodore. This was a fun video. I love looking up data. I love finding all this information on baby names. And I spent a lot of time looking up these nicknames. So I hope you enjoyed them. Give this video a like and follow along. I talk about my personal life on this channel, but I also talk about tons of different baby name themes. So subscribe and stick around because we have a great time here. Thanks for being here and happy naming.